So guys, welcome back to the next episode of Amateur Scouting Report from the Free Amateurs. Next player we're going to look at is a player we've linked with quite heavily over the last couple of days. Is a guy called Josh Madger. I hope there's no more mic issues today. Obviously, there's been a couple of mic issues, but hopefully this one's a little bit better for you guys. Thank you for positive, constructive feedback as always. So, Josh Madger, a professional footballer who currently plays for Bordeaux. And he's a Nigerian international. He's 21 years old from Lewisham. You guys are probably familiar for a while his time at Sunderland. Any of you guys that have watched the Netflix documentary know he was a bit of a goal scoring machine for them. Um, he played his youth football at Crystal Palace, Fulham, Man City, and began his professional career, as I just mentioned, at Sunderland. Um, he made 49 appearances for them, scoring 17 goals. In the January of 2019, joined Bordeaux. Um, those of you will know, uh, Sunderland, I believe, were relegated that season. So his time at Bordeaux, his first season, um, he hadn't had much time to show his ability, to be fair. Um, he only managed 196 minutes um, from his transfer in 2019. However, term, Major has had the opportunity to feature in 21 of those League One fixtures thus far. Um, now 21, Major has been delivering some noteworthy performances in France top of this season. And more than a hat-trick he scored against Grindin's, with Grindin's 6-0 win over Olympia um, back in December. It may be fair to say that Maggio has truly been taking the opportunity to announce himself in France's top tier. Uh, Udo have utilised formations featuring a sole centre forward in majority of their games this season. Um, they usually a four, a three four two one, with Maggio sitting in the centre forward role. Here's his stats for the season. So as you can see, 21 games, six goals, two assists. Um, total in all competitions for 24 games, eight goals and three assists. Mm -hmm. As you can see from this image here, um, image above uh, provides us with an example of the way that Major typically fits into the way Bordeaux play. As you can see here, Major occupied a central striking role, all those 3 4 2 1 shape during this passage of play. At this particular moment, we can see all those left wing back in possession of the ball in the process of carrying it up the pitch. Meanwhile, Bulldoze left back is carrying the ball into the opposition half of the pitch. This prompts Major to increase his movement and begin his run in an attempt to get himself in position. He can bounce onto the end of a through ball, creating a one on one situation. So, as you can see, there he sits there. And the fullbacks there waiting for him to move. And you can see as the move is peeled away and the opportunity opens up for himself. As it says, the next image shows us how Major's run develops this passage of move. Um, and we can see that he's managed to find himself space, and which did go on and lead to a goal for Major, which is fantastic. Um, he's also credited for fantastic movement in the box. So image one shows here how the fullback is cut inside. And Maju is there with two defenders around him. You know, as any great striker will tell you, move away from your players, create the space. Again, this would this led to a goal for him, which is fantastic. Um, also credited for his efficient finishing. Um, he has excellent finishing and can pick up positions, which leaves defenders very, very nervous. An excellent ball carry that drives forward in possession. Major opens up his body slightly, the direction of the playmaker. In doing so, he manages to prepare himself to receive the ball on the inside of his foot and set himself up the ball away. Major's composure and reliable finishing ability helps him to be effective from all these situations. The 21-year-old forward can be seen slotting the ball home after having taken one or two touches many times this season. conclude um it's clear that major 
Madger possesses a variety of different attributes which help him to perform effectively for Bulldoze attack. Some major key attributes such as his pace, intelligent movement in a variety of different positions off the ball fit the way Bulldoze currently play. Um, the tactics are helping him well to affect, uh, to affect the system. While Magic could improve in some areas such as his aerial presence, this isn't generally too significant for Bulldoze. However, if he was to come to West Ham, we would like to put the crosses in at times. This may be an area he will need to improve. Um, this is a player I like. I liked him at Sunderland. I thought we should have took a punt on him when he was at Sunderland. Um, as I say, a good finisher. Knows where the goal is. Very young as well. We'll probably get him for a good price if we were to get him. Um, Sunderland, as I say, 17 in 49. Nigeria, he's only played once, he's yet to score for them. Exciting, young, fast striker. Um, also heavily linked with Rangers, I believe. Um, fitting well under Jermaine Defoe. So maybe Jermaine Defoe has give a nod there to Gerard to say, look, this guy's young. He reminds me of myself. Um, and we'll wait and see, guys. Um, I hope you're enjoying this. Not as detailed as the Ezzy one. There wasn't too much information on this guy. Um, yeah, I hope that's enough information for you guys to uh, suggest. If you know any more, leave it in the comments to help other people out. Thank you. Please subscribe.